Hello everyone, and welcome to my round 9 tips. Um, overall, round 8 went alright. Um, I got 7, but, you know, it was a pretty straightforward round, you know. Thought Richmond would win, but a uh, Geelong smash, which is good, because I'm a Geelong supporter, so, yep, that's a good win. Uh, this game is pretty 50-50. I thought Gold Coast would win, because it's at Metricon, but, you know, good win by St Kilda was a good comeback. And then the rest were right. I think most people, though, got all of those right. I'll be at round 9, starting off with St Kilda and Geelong at Marvel. Um, I'll tip Geelong for this one. You know, they should win this game after beating Richmond by that much. I'll tip them by 22 points. Hopefully it's more than that. But, yeah, I'll tip Geelong by 22. Next up we have Sydney and Collingwood. I'll tip Sydney. They should they should get this win against Collingwood. I don't see why they wouldn't, so we'll tip Sydney. Um, Hawthorne and North Melbourne next. Um, this is pretty tough because North Melbourne last week against Collingwood, that was their best chance to win, but they didn't win it. Now they're against Hawthorne, who are 17th, so another opportunity for them to get a win. Um... But we'll tip Hawthorne though, it's at their home ground and they usually win at their home ground there, so Hawthorne should win this. Gold Coast in Brisbane, we'll tip uh, Brisbane. Yeah, we'll tip Brisbane, they should they should be able to get this win easily against Gold Coast. Uh, Richmond and GWS um, at Marvel for some reason. Not sure why it's at Marvel, because there are no other, there are no MCG games on Saturday, I'm not sure why this is at Marvel. Maybe there's going to be bad weather or something, so they'd make it at Marvel. Anyway, uh, we'll tip Richmond to win. They should should beat the Giants. They should beat it. Should beat them, not it. Um, Port Adelaide and the Bulldogs at the Adelaide Oval. This is probably the bit, the probably the biggest game of the round. Um, so far, I've just tipped favourites like usual. <laughs> Um, if anyone's to beat Port at the Adelaide Oval, I reckon the Bulldogs, the Bulldogs can do it. Um, Port didn't play that good against Adelaide. I mean, they had a big win, but they didn't, it wasn't that big, like, it wasn't that impressive, you know? The Bulldogs, though, they almost lost to Carlton, so you'd think Port will win this one, but I don't know, I feel like the Bulldogs can do it. I'm going to tip the Bulldogs. Mainly because so far I've just tipped favourites and you're never going to get 9 out of 9 just tipping favourites. That never happens. There's normally two There's normally two games around roughly that the non-favourite team wins. And I reckon the Bulldogs can do it, so I'll tip them. Essendon Fremantle at Marvel. Um, this is pretty tough because uh, Essendon... I tip against Essendon every single round. And Fremantle... Yeah, I mean, I don't know. They haven't been doing that well lately. Um, this is a pretty close one. I think Essendon are the slight favourites. But Fremantle could win this game. They definitely could. Um, we'll tip Essendon. I think they should get the job done at Marvel against Fremantle. They should. Um, Melbourne and Carlton, as we said earlier, Carlton almost beat the Bulldogs uh, in round 8. And Melbourne, they've got to lose a game eventually. They're surely going to lose at some time. And considering Carlton almost beat the Bulldogs, can they do it? Can they upset Melbourne? Possibly, but probably won't happen. We'll tip Melbourne and we'll tip West Coast. Um... Should I change anything? I'll stick with Geelong. I'll stick with I'll stick with Sydney. Will North Melbourne get their first win against Hawthorne? It's it's Hawthorne, so I won't be surprised. But you know, because it's at the University of Tasmania Stadium, we'll stick with them. We'll definitely stick with Brisbane. We'll stick with the Tigers. I'll stick with the Bulldogs. I reckon they can do it against Port if they play at their best. Um, should we tip Fremantle? I've only tipped one team that's not the favourite. 
Um, this is tough. We'll, uh, we'll come back to this. Let's just do the gauntlet. Um, so I tip the giants in round eight for the gauntlet and they, they only just, they just got the win against Essendon. So that's good, I guess, for me. Still in the gauntlet, but they just got it. Um, so yeah, for round nine for the gauntlet, um, I'm not going to tip St. Kilda. Um, no, I won't tip any of these two. I could tip Hawthorne and get them out the way with because Hawthorne are a bottom four team, you know, so I could tip Hawthorne, but that means I'd be tipping against North Melbourne again for the gauntlet, which I've done pretty much every round so far. Um, I won't tip Brisbane this round. I won't tip Richmond. I won't tip any of these two. Could tip Essendon. Because they're not, you know, the best side. So I could get them out of the way with. I won't tip Carlton. I won't tip the Eagles. I don't know. Fremantle might win this game. I'm probably not going to tip them. I'll probably tip Hawthorne. We'll tip Hawthorne for the goal that get them out of the way with. Because... They're a bottom four team. Surely they'll beat North Melbourne. So, um, yeah. Hawthorne, please win this game. Please win this game, Hawthorne. Coming from a Cats fan, telling Hawthorne to win. That really happens. But yeah, we'll tip Hawthorne for the gauntlet. Um, so back to the tips. Probably not going to change anything. I think we'll stick with what we've got on this so far. I think I'll stick with this. I don't know, Fremantle, I've just got a feeling that Fremantle might win this. I don't know. It's tough. Um, I think I'll stick with this. I think Essendon should get the job done against Fremantle. I'm not confident, but I've tipped against Essendon every single round, so I'll tip for them this round. And yeah, I'll, this is what I'll stick with. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.